Remote events and remote functions are 60 seconds. Let's go! A remote event and remote function are basically a telephone that lets two scripts communicate with each other. Both allow you to communicate with the client and the server. These are the main methods for a remote event and a remote function. Do you see a pattern? If not, I'll tell you. The methods on the client side have the word client in it, and the server side have the word server in it. Here is a basic example of a remote event. We have this countdown function, and we want to display it to all the players. To do that, we just refer to the event, and since this is on the server, we use the fire all client function, which is basically sending a request to all the players in the server. Then on the client side, we need a function that listens to the request, so on the client side, we type in on client event. When we run it, it updates the timer on the client side, so the player is able to see the timer counting down. The remote function is pretty much the same, but returns a value. That's it, and I'll see you in the next one.